On 11, a chaotic scene unfolding tonight in Compton as protesters clashed with sheriff deputies after the deadly shooting of an 18 year old. Eyewitness News reporter Leanne Suter joins us live now from the scene with new video and details on what sparked the unrest. Leanne. All is quiet tonight here at the Compton Civic Center, a far different scene from just a few hours ago when a march against police brutality turned into a heated confrontation. Demonstrators face off with deputies in Compton as a peaceful protest takes a violent turn. They opened fire and they started um, throwing rubber shots at people. People were protesting peacefully. They decided to attack them and drop a bomb on them and also tear gas. Protesters capturing the chaos on camera. The trouble began when deputies fired pepper balls at several protesters, demonstrators then taking aim with water bottles and debris. And then all of a sudden we hear shots coming out, people started running in different directions, but they made a huge mistake because let's not forget the whole world knows Compton. What do we want? When do we want it? The peaceful protest began at the scene of Thursday's deadly deputy involved shooting. Authorities say Andres Guardado pulled out a gun when confronted by deputies. The 18 year old shot six times. When will the violence end? It's who's next? Am I next? Guardado's family says he was shot in the back as he ran from deputies and are insisting he did not own a gun. His father joining today's march to demand justice and an end to police brutality. I say thank you everybody for coming here. You know, uh, I, can, I say I'm feeling very bad to talk, you know, because I'm feeling really good, you know. Those turning out today say the 18 year old's death is just the latest in a long history of lives lost at the hands of law enforcement. Maybe now everyone can see that new training is required and that defund the police really means let's create an organization that is really for peace. The sheriff's department says only pepper balls and flashbangs were used against the crowd to try to break up the gathering. We saw at least several people being treated for their injuries, at least one person taken into custody. Live in Compton, Lee. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Click the ABC7 logo to subscribe to our Eyewitness News YouTube channel.